Knox Elliott and Jarvis completed the Confederation Life Building in 1892, the state-of-the-art office tower was one of the tallest structures in the city. This castle-like heritage building survived a fire and near demolition and then went on to house the Sapphire Tavern. During the rebellious 1960s, the conservative streets of downtown Toronto were transformed by live music. Along the Young Street Strip, the Toronto sound was developed at clubs like Edison Hotel, Cock Door, the Zanzibar, the Brown Derby, and right here at the Sapphire. The silky voiced singer Jackie Shane, described as a cross between Prince, Little Richard, and Eartha Kitt, arrived in the early 60s, adding glamour to the Toronto sound. Jackie was born in Nashville and traveled extensively in the 50s and 60s through America, Montreal and Toronto with other black musicians. Even in Toronto, many clubs excluded blacks, except as entertainers. When Jackie was in town, we walked around from the Sapphire. We'd walk straight up Young Street, and Jackie, of course, looked a little unusual, to say the least. You know, he'd have the sequin outfit and the makeup, and nobody bothered him. When I'm walking down Young Street, you won't believe this, but you know some of them funny people have the nerve to point the finger at me and grin and smile and whisper. But you know that don't worry, Jackie, because I know I look good. And every Monday morning I laugh and grin on my way to the bank because I got mine. I look good, I got money, and everything else that I need. You know what my slogan is, baby, do what you want, just know what you're doing. As long as you don't force your will and your way on anybody else, live your life because ain't nobody sanctified and holy. You Jackie's I mean? charisma and warmth never failed to bring the house down at the Sapphire, where he had a regular weekly show. His album, Jackie Shane Live, was recorded here in 1963. I'm gonna enjoy the chicken, the His hit song, Any Other Way, was number two on the charts for nine weeks. Tell her that I'm happy. Tell her that I'm gay. Tell her I'm happy. Any other way. At a time when homophobia was rampant well before Canada's decriminalization of homosexual acts in 1969, Jackie Shane challenged boundaries. Just walk in the dark. 